Hey, what's up everybody? My name is TrophyNut, the babbling Belgian, and welcome back to Bioshock 2, the Minerva's Den DLC. We're right, uh, well, in front of a terminal with Spitfire on it. So, uh, one of, well, a few of, uh, Wall's technicians decided they could make a game on this terminal. So, let's play it. It's actually rather interesting, so let's start and let's play this. Because I think, how does this work again? So I think there's a there's actually a trophy linked to this. Because the annoying thing is that it fires in the direction you're going. I think I got it. Yep, high score. There we go. So that's I think it's ten thousand points on uh, Spitfire. And that was actually my first try. That was. Didn't think that would happen at my first try. Don't get any money out of that, but it's it's a, a, a quite a little a nice uh, little uh, Easter egg over there. Traitor! Hey, Felix. I hear Porter is really happy about the new trajectory calculation routine. You know, the one that we worked on for six months, the one you took all the credit for. Oh, that reminds me. If you're looking for the key to your brand new office, you might want to check in the Circus of Values down the hall. Hope you brought your milk money, asshole. So there we go. So that's why the guy's key is in the uh, in the Circus of Value, not because he put it there himself, but because his uh, his colleagues weren't too happy with him stealing their ideas. There we go. And then we have the upgraded machine gun right here as well. So there we go. Uh, another, I think that's our last weapon we needed actually. And then another vacuum bolt. Let's rack this thing as well. Because there's usually a lot of interesting stuff in here. Anti-personnel rounds can also be used by us, of course. And then, uh, hmm, let's see. We still need that key, of course. But I don't think I have enough money yet. No, I still need about 100 hundred more dollars to even access that key. So let's uh, gather up some money, shall we? And explore the other areas. And uh, remember that this is still here. Just gonna go with the thermal cell until we're out of that. No, no more money on these corpses. Okay, fair enough. And that means we're pretty much done for this area for now. Except, of course, the office at the end there. So for the operations manager office. And... Uh, then the key. The key. We need the key from the Circus of Value. So let's get back to the center area and go... I think I'm going to just go to the other side first. To um, where we should be going. Because we need that signal beacon. Let's go over here. What's this? It's glowing. It's probably an atom corpse. Let's head over here first. That's locked. Okay. That means we need to go left then, I suppose. Yeah, I only played this DLC once, and there's airlock. That's probably nothing as well, although... The seafloor outside Minerva's den is a machine graveyard. With a little luck, you should find the beacon we need out there. Ooh, so yeah, we need to go outside and try and find that uh, signal beacon we need. And we got an upgraded shotgun now as well, so let's hack this thing. I'm not gonna buy it out, because I need the money. And just take it easy. Just take it easy and get some trap rivets, if I would be able to pick them up. Yeah, I'm not just not gonna buy something, because, yeah, we need the, the, the uh, money. Rocket spears. Unauthorized tampering with computer equipment is a punishable offense. Yeah, it is, but I don't think they're gonna, they're gonna mind for now. Is that a camera? Yeah, it is. So it's behind. Ooh. Can I? There we go. My camera. My camera. Did I miss anything by just sprinting along here? Yeah, I did. Another health kit for me. Let's go outside then, I suppose. That looks like a trap. Looks like there's a... <coughs> Hi. You want, you want my attention? There you go. You have my attention. Ooh, that guy doesn't look so good. Some damn fool stuck his finger in the socket. <laughs> to get out through the airlock, you'll have to break the circuit somehow. Uh, hack that thing? 
There we go. Secure door is now unlocked. There we go. So now we can get outside if we want to. But I'm just gonna... Is there something here? What is this? This looks like there's a, a possibility that there might be a turret popping out. And there's another atom slug. Gonna have to remember that when we're out there. Anything else here? No. Okay, let's head outside. Ooh, never mind. Signal beacon. I figured out how to reprogram a bathysphere signal beacon to scramble Lamb's torpedoes. But I need access to a bathysphere, and Porter's got the only one in the den locked away at his private dock. Son of a bitch, why doesn't he open up? Because he doesn't want you to steal his bathysphere, probably. There we go, that, that, uh, well, the splice setup was already dead, of course. Now let's head into the airlock and go outside. Look for a down bathysphere. They each had a signal beacon we could use. Ooh, what's that? Aww. Ooh, I always like these, uh, outside trips. So right here next to the window there's an atom slug. Thank you. Every little bit helps. Uh, I hear noises. Ah, probably up there. Because there's a few atom slugs around here. If I'm not mistaken. It's just always fun to explore the ocean floor. But I mean, look at this. Ooh, shark! Shark. Maybe not jumping around all that much. Might uh, get the attention of the shark. Make yourself at home, Sigma. Soon you also will be rusting here among the trash, used up by Porter and tossed on the heap. Uh, no. Porter is a nice man. He just wants his wife back. This looks like there might be... Yeah, there we go. Let's start the atom from our little outside trip already. What's up? Is that a boat? Yeah, that's a boat. That is a boat that just crashed here for some reason. Any other atom slugs? Don't see any. I'm just gonna have to pick up the signal beacon. And that's mine. Thank you. That'll do the trick. Take the beacon to the master input console in the programming wing. That paranoid bastard Wall had it installed in his office. Oh, look at that. There we go. Surprise, Sigma! Um... Those are my bolts, though. Oh, so that's Wall himself. Yeah, I kind of forgot about that. So... So I think he he just activated the camera I hacked. That, that is actually really funny. I wonder if that, if that moves uh, forward. If the damage he takes now is uh, move forward when we uh, have to eventually face him. Not that that's a spoiler. I mean, we kind of realized that we're going to have to face him at one point. So, kind of spoiled the surprise, of course, because we know there's a, a, a drone here now. No, no, don't attack it. That's mine. There we go. What's this? Oh! Is that gonna... Attack my bolts? No, it doesn't. Okay. There we go. I missed a lot of items in here, apparently. Money, sardines. Yeah, the sardines are the most important thing in the game, of course. A bit of sardines are always healthy. There we go. Oop. If I manage to aim with my spear gun, that would be nice. Too many bolts. There we go, and then the spear I jammed in the wall here. Thank you very much. Let's just take another heave hypo. I can, uh, I can always use that. Somebody was laughing. Delicate like a mystery. What? Yep. Oh, come on. Um, yeah. So he's a bit mad at me, obviously. There we go. Now I can actually use that bolt for me if I want to. But first, let's just take out the big daddy here. Heavy rivets. Uh, burst cell as a start, probably, and then a few rocket spears. 
Um, hmm. Yeah, that's pretty much it. That's gonna have to do. Boom in the face, and then... Oh no, rockets. Rockets. There we go. And I think I can actually fire in his face, and that's gonna do more damage as well. Damn, he's tough. He's really tough. Let's go for the heavy rivets. Uh oh. Jesus Christ, this thing is tanky. I think I'm gonna lure him. Jesus. I'm gonna lure him over here. Doesn't he come over here? Yeah, he does. There we go. Oh. Oh, gold. Jesus Christ, that thing was tough. Okay, I clearly never played this on hard. Um, because we can't boost our damage against these guys. Since, well, this is, uh... This doesn't have a research camera. So let's gather the spears. Luckily I could bring him over here to get the bots to do the dirty work. Uh, we almost have enough money now. Which is good. Because we then can get the key and a bit more items if I'm not mistaken. Ooh, I'm going to have to be careful. Because I don't want to spend money. But of course I don't want to die at this point as well. Because it is a bit fidgety in this game. The saving. Ooh. There's a lot of trap rivets underneath there. Though there might have been only three now. Over here. Nope, no gene bank over here. Where is the gene bank? Is there one... Is there even one around here? Because I want to... Get another tonic. I read you now from the machine's prediction. Sigma enters Minerva's den, encounters hostility. Sigma enters Wall's chambers. You see, the thinker has chosen me. He does not care what I once did. There we go, and those electricity bolts actually help me out. Uh, stunning those uh, turrets. Um, cola, cola, cola. I like hop up cola because that heals me a bit, I think. Or not. Just brings my Eve back up. Ooh, this is getting tense because I'm almost dead and I just keep finding Eve hypos instead of health kits. First aid kits. I really need a first aid kit. Anyone, please. Can't use any money either. I'm just going to have to get by with the items I get from hacking these things. Spear ammo. Okay. That's something. A lot of hop-up cola, because Reed Wall likes his cola. Um, that's my security bot. Nothing around here? No? I, I could have sworn there, was, there were more items over here, but maybe because we're playing on hard, there's not as much. Anything underneath there? Nope. Only a lot of cola, because he was caffeinated. Well, heavily, heavily caffeinated. The books are the code. Adam makes it hard to sleep, forgetting things lately. So this... This is an emergency reminder for the code to my... <coughs> private storage area. I won't record the number, but... Remember, just look at the four groups of books on the shelf. And this sequence is obvious. So that is interesting, because Wall realized at a certain point that he was splicing up too much, that he was losing his mind, as we hear him at the moment. 
and therefore he started well making reminders for himself so the books are of course these ones so two three four one is the code that we can now enter in his uh, very personal desk code keypad so two three four one the game kind of well drains the fun out of that by putting the code over there but there we go wait for it no nothing Aha, yeah, of course, now the bookcase is gone and now we can enter. Holy shit, who murdered who over here? He has a secret, uh, Tannenbaum, Adam, question mark. Secret compartment, of course, where he has the signal beacon set up. The master input console. There we go. Good, it's all hooked up. I can run the hack sequence from here. Just one minute... Oh, I don't like to hear that. Oh, I was hoping I would get more money out of that. Let's take the hacked signal beacon. That should do it. I hope. If the hack turned out right, you are now the proud owner of one homemade signal jammer. Okay, that is very interesting, but I still need that money. I, although I still don't know where that key would worries you with work Sophia on. Lamb's torpedoes? Ha! He fills your head with foolish visions of freedom. I can provide you more immediate concerns. Yeah, probably. Ooh, first aid kit. It's dancing, Daddy's oh. dancing. Oh shit. No. Jesus Christ, come on. Get away from me, seriously. Jesus Christ. This is a lot harder than I remember, but yeah, it is hard, of course. 236, so I'm almost out of... Well, I almost have enough money to get the key from the Circus of Value. And I'm in no state to try and get the, a gather off here. Because um, I can't repair my... Hmm. I'm just going to try and find that uh, gene bank. If I can rearrange a few things over here, that might help me out in a different way. So far, so good. I can feel the sunlight already. Now we just print out the machine code from the Thinker's central processor so I can take it to the surface and start to rebuild. Computer core access is at the far end of Ops. Ooh, I thought I had a bit more money here, but apparently just not enough. So let's go back to the beginning here. Might have missed a few items over here. And otherwise there's the gene bank. Okay, so this... I can try and swap out... Sports Boost... For the... Uh, handyman. So that allows me to use Eve... And get everything done that way. To repair my, uh, my bots that way. Um, no items in here. So, back at the gather, I'm going to repair everything here that I still can repair. I don't think I can repair cameras if they're broken. Oh, almost there, money-wise. Almost there, money-wise, but I just need to be really careful here. I think if I now gather this corpse before he does, I might be able to get in a safer position to uh, take care of everything. Because this can get a little hectic. Over there! 
There we go, all things going well for now, not taking any on any damage. Just gonna be careful here. Oh shit, that was a nice hit, I'm gonna have to use my... Ooh. Is he attacking me or what? He's not attacking me, is he? Don't think he is. He took some damage. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. Thank you. For that, because that was okay. So that wasn't too bad. I'm just gonna pick up mine. I'm just gonna pick up mine. We're friends. We're friends. All oh, the dirt didn't survive. That is annoying. But there are a few corpses here that should get me. Uh, that should get me to enough dollars to get the key from the Circus of Value, which is good. And I have a bit more atom to uh, distribute as well. I'm gonna take the spear gun because it's the fastest way to deal with splicers. I'm hoping I won't come across another heavy one, because that might be the death of me. Uh, just, yeah, just just do that. You're doing really, really well. So let's get back to the others. Okay, that was loud. That was in my ears. There we go. Saved you. Um, where is the key? I think it's actually, yeah, it's over there. I'm going the wrong way. It's over there on the right. I think Daddy still has some damage on him, but I don't want to... I'm not going to attack him at this stage, because I can't heal at the moment. I have no health packs left. Yeah, there's another corpse. Don't want to use that just yet. I'm just going to get his key. Where does the key work on? So this is ah, this is the door to his yeah. Okay, no, no, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get rid of my little sister just yet. So there we go, Felix Burnbaum's office, and that can get us into his office because that's of course where the the audio diary was pinned to. Each with its own function, its own purpose. Seriously, is someone in there, Mr. Burnbaum? Are you in here? Take it easy, take it easy. Just calm down. Is he just gonna keep doing that? There we go. In the face! So bandages. Phosphorus buck. That's also the first time we're encountering this in this DLC. Oh, bit of money. Ooh, he looks bad. And there's another dead cat. Again, Bioshock with the dead cats. Thermal cells and behind the scenes. We make it all run. The brains in those bots and cameras, that's us. Automatic bathysphere navigation, calculating genetic probabilities for new plasmids, health regulating water pressure so this place ain't a fish tank. It's all Rapture Central Computing. Not that we get the recognition. Hey, funny thing about living in the city tomorrow, everybody takes it for granted. Indeed they do, Felix, indeed they do. So that's a lot of interesting items we get there in, in uh, return for that money. Staying the aspirin. Is there anything underneath his desk that I need to check out? There's no buttons or anything? Okay, so that means I still need to hack the safe and I'm hoping that gets me a bit of uh, help kits, please. Nope, just dollars, mini turrets and first cells. Could only collect one more mini turret, which means I should actually try and get that, uh, that hack going. Armor piercing rounds might come in handy as well. And now when we return, how many splices will there be? I'm just going to buy health packs. It's any, all I need at the moment, health packs. Okay, so that gives me a bit more leeway to try and get this gather going. A gathering, let's... Um, hmm. Could you use the three trap spears I found? I think there's a few more hidden in the base area. Um, but I could try and do that here. So there we go, set up rather nicely, two mini turrets, a lot of trap rivets and trap spears. So let's go with the anti-personnel rounds. I put myself in a corner around here. So I have a nice view on everything. 
And maybe even go for Gravity Well. Although that might fuck up my uh, Insect Swarm. Might fuck up the Mini Turrets. Okay. There we go, that's one down. That's another one down. It's one third of the gathering going already, which is good. Hello? Anyone? They're... yeah, they're all dying. Ow! That was a grenade. Get back. That was rather effective. And then let's pick her back up. Maybe I can even gather a few more things back up as well. Can't pick up the mini turrets again. But I can get two more mini turrets from uh, Felix's office. Can't get the trap spear back. That is sad. But that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna get the, the two mini turrets and I'll see you guys back in operations in a second. And of course I'm just gonna rescue the little sister here as well while we're at it. Goodbye little girl. See you on the flip side. There we go. There we go. Bolt uh, the rest of Gravity Well. Adding um, a few more effects so I can make a trap. A Gravity Well trap if I want to. And then there's the... Um, the other effect is that they get uh, acid on their faces when, I, when the explosion goes off. I thought there were more trap spears around here. Well, that, this is awkward. Like without automation. Oh shit! Um, um, that's that's not what I wanted to do. Raptures. Central computing keeps life running smoothly. There we go. An alpha series. That is interesting. I bit my tongue there. That's why that sounded a bit weird. That was interesting, so let's ooh, let's heal up everything, because there's a lot going on here, and I wanted just to have some trap spears, but that's not gonna work. Oh, wow. She took that like a champ. Did I jam one in here? Yeah, okay. So, let's. Um, I do want to get that last... Lost Big Daddy down, so if I can, I'm just Stay gonna. Back, huh? I I Jesus Christ, these Houdini splices are tough. Because I have the. Um, how's it called? The Headhunter Plasmid uh, Tonic. And that apparently doesn't. doesn't change the fact that they don't die with a single spear to the face, as they should. What was that? I heard someone coughing. Are you in the water? You're not. You're still damaged, which is good. Um, one more rocket spear, which is not good. Quite a bit of armor piercing range, which might work, and a heat seeking rocket. And then the rocket spear, if I can. Come on, get in the water. Are you in the water? That counts as in the water. Ooh, God. Ooh, shit. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. That was a hit. I can do a 10 burst with this one. Oh, that was in the face. I wonder if that did full damage. It didn't have enough ammo anymore. It's a bit more money. And let's adopt this little sister. Hmm, okay. I have this hacked, so let's get more uh, health kits, because I'm running. Constantly running low on health kits. But with that done, 
I think I am going to take a little break. So when we get back, we're going to do the last two gathers. Because I think there is... No, there's two more. Ooh, I'm actually mistaken. There is another little sister left after this one. So uh, when we get back, we're going to do that, all that. And uh, try to get to the Tinker. Because, uh, yeah, we're starting to get closer and closer to the ending of this DLC. But yeah, that's all for next episode. If you enjoyed this one, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And uh, yeah, see you guys next time. Goodbye.